Welcome back to Cali Linux and Digital Forensics. My name is James D. Murray and here I will cover what you need to get started in using Cali Linux for digital forensics work. In this module we will take a look at what you need to get Cali Linux running quickly on a computer or in a virtual environment, how to update the tools on Cali and install software packages, including Cali's Meta packages. We will also look at what you need to make Cali into a forensics workstation for your own forensics lab. And finally, I will cover a few native Linux commands that are useful when performing digital forensic examinations. Kali Linux can run on many different types of hardware platforms and computing environments. Kali is commonly installed on a laptop or desktop computer's hard drive. Kali is capable of running on many different types of computers, including most of those with Intel compatible or ARM processors. The quickest way to get Kali up and running is booting from a live DVD disk in a computer's optical drive, from a USB memory stick, or from an ISO file attached to a virtual machine. Kali can also be installed directly into a virtual machine as a guest operating system. You can install Kali from a live DVD or download Kali's virtual machine files pre-built for VMware and VirtualBox. And finally, Kali can be installed in flash memory and run on an embedded system, such as the Raspberry Pi and Beagle Board, and even some tablets, like the Galaxy Note 10. So with all these environments supported by Kali, you've got some options for the hardware in your forensics lab. Running Linux is a great way to get some more usefulness out of older hardware, so those old laptops in your junk drawer aren't recyclables just yet. For this course, I will demonstrate running Kali Linux booted from a live DVD and running as a virtual machine. For my demos, I am running a 32-bit release of Kali 1.1.0 in VMware Workstation 11 on a Windows 7 computer with an Intel i7-950 processor and 24 gigabytes of installed RAM. However, you don't need this beefy of a system to follow my demos. Any laptop with an Intel i5 processor and 60 gigabytes of RAM should be plenty to play along or you can just sit and watch and take notes. Either way, let us forge ahead with getting ourselves a copy of Cali 